strong in that field. It could just cost the two million dollars for two people. So they uh, share it a lot of the time. Uh, and uh, theoretical understanding uh, with the simplified theory we have appears to give us some qualitative uh, description and understanding so far. So this field is uh, revolutionary, green energy technology, I mean, emerging as the, this technology. <coughs> and I think we are creating a very new field, multidisciplinary kind of Now, we were already dreaming this will happen. Uh, but until we have a breakthrough, it, we couldn't. Uh, we, Okay, uh, so this is my logo. Cold region is becoming hot. Thank you very much, Professor Kim. And let me just quickly ask, does anyone feel stepped on or have something to refute? Because otherwise, more detailed discussions, I'd like to keep it private because we're so slammed. Yes? Uh, I apologize in advance, Dr. Kim, for asking me this, but I have just three quick You say you are, you are harassing me? I apologize. Me? <laughs> now, Callion implied that they had tested nickel pure isotopes. Do you have any evidence, any, uh, any notebook entries, any invoices, anything? That not not to me. Uh, unfortunately, let me tell you. Uh, second question. <laughs> yeah, just a second. John, you? John was supposed to be here, but. Uh, they had the uh, air traffic controller strike at the Milan, so he couldn't show up here. And I'm not prepared to answer all of the questions. I, I, I know, but I'm, some of these questions are on yeah. many people's minds. The radiation detection, I designed a lot of that equipment. Did they collect any data outside of the equipment that I had designed? I don't know. The third question was yeah. the heat that they claimed, eight, eight plus kilowatts, why wasn't the room a steam bath? that's a lot of heat in a small room. Eight kilowatt of steam is a heck of a lot of heat. The heat of a room about the size of a... Well, thank you very much. I'm sorry that I have to call the session just for this reason. And please listen, listen closely to this. We're so seriously slammed. And as you know, we have a pretty complex uh, structure here. At 11.30, regardless of where we are, those who have an arranged tour at 11.30 will need to meet the bus. Otherwise, we'll lose the tour. The other thing is that the break will go, um, let's say, till 10.30. That'll put us a half hour behind, but we'll pick up a little bit of time. So let's break till 10.30 and resume. Thank you.